Hello, my name is Jerry and I attend Kipper High School and I'll be doing a cooking demonstration today with three foods. I will have chicken breast, I'll be having broccoli, and also I'll be having corn. Now you may be wondering why I am making this cooking demonstration. Well, it's actually because of the problem around with um, food insecurities, which are we don't have enough resources or money to have the nutritious food that you need. Therefore, um, it can lead to obesity, diabetes, and other um, health effects. And only a reason is because people don't know how to actually make healthy foods with the resources that they can get from a local grocery store. Now, since I'm making this food, and I have to say why this is all healthy. So, the broccoli is frozen, and that gives it the richness, the richness, and nutritiousness, and nutrition as it was when it was freshly made. Instead of it being in a can which has high sodium, it's not frozen. So after I do this, I'm going to put a little water in it, just in time. And I'm going to put it on the stove. Now, um, I'm going to put some seasoning on it too, just, just for a little flavor. And then with the seasoning, there's nothing wrong with the seasoning because there's no extra fats or anything in the seasoning, so it's okay to add seasoning to your food as much as you want, but not too much. Too much is not good for you. And now with the broccoli. The broccoli is basically the same. No. Now with the corn. It has all the nutrients as it would have if it was just picked out outside since it was frozen. And then for the corn, you might not think this is healthy, but I'm going to add just a little bit better just for flavor purposes too. And just a little bit is okay. Now I'm going to put a little bit of butter in the corn. Okay, now while that's cooking, I'm going to make the chicken. Now to make the chicken, all you have to do is this. Get the chicken in this and let all the water drain out. Spray the, spray the pan with the cooking spray so that the chicken don't stick to the bottom. 
then after that, all right, so now, I'm going to bring this part over here, and I'm going to start to put the chicken on it, one by one, and spread them out. Now, since this chicken isn't fried, it's way more healthier because it's less calories. Because in fried chicken, there's about um, 300 calories or uh, 16 grams of fat. But in baked chicken, you have about 8 grams of fat and more so 100 calories in it. So that's one I fit. So after this, I will proceed to put it in the oven, which I preheated to 375. So now I gotta season it before I put it up there. And also, now the seasoning once again has no extra fat added to it, just there for the flavor. Now we'll put it in the oven. And now we'll let that cook for about 15 to 20 minutes. Alright, and then we're back. Actually, the chicken took a little bit longer than 15 minutes, so I had to keep on checking on it. So, you make your chicken, just make sure that you have to keep checking on it, checking in, checking in, until it's ready. So, now we're taking out the chicken. Now since everything is done, now I can place them on my nice little pot. Here's the broccoli. Let me get this in there. Finally, okay, so now since everything is done, I'm going to explain to you how this food selection is healthier and cheaper than fast food restaurants. Okay, so first I'm gonna get my serving. So I'm gonna make my meal for the night actually. So have my corn. So I'm gonna get my piece of broccoli. 
broccoli. So now that everything's done, I'm going to explain to you how this food choice is healthier than the fast food restaurant's food choices. So with all this food, it all costs around $12. And with one serving, it will be approximately $1.87. And then it will be only 240 calories. Now if you go to a restaurant like Bojangles and get, let's say, Around the same thing, some chicken tenders and two sides, it'll be called Chicken Supreme Dinner, right? And then that will cost six dollars and nine cents, and then it'll be one thousand three hundred and thirty calories. So you see how compared to Bojangles, this chicken, broccoli, and corn costs way less and has way less calories. If you go to McDonald's, which you would go maybe because you thought it was cheaper. You would go off the dollar menu and uh, get some fries and a cheeseburger, and that would be around two dollars and fifty nine cents. And you see how, even though you think it's cheaper, it's still not as cheap as this food. And also, the burger and fries from McDonald's cost around um, no, the burger and fries at McDonald's have six hundred and ninety one calories. So that's how you see that. This is cheaper and also healthier than the other foods. And that's as all done. You gotta remember, y'all got to clean up after yourself. So now, get all my trash that I had. And I'm gonna put it in the trash. Thank you for watching my video and I hope that it helps you out. I'm Jay Royster.